Hey Bama Nation, sitting here via Skype with Kyle Boltz getting ready for Bad Beat 7 against Mike Jasper. Uh, I just want to ask you, Kyle, how's the training going? Oh, it's going great. All right. With, with a lot of work, getting a lot of stuff done, getting ready for Mike Jasper. Now going into this fight, you actually had a, uh, a two-year layoff a little bit. So uh, what was your decision to step away for a while? Oh, it wasn't actually a decision. It was just uh, multiple fights falling through. I actually had a fight in Vegas where I made it to the show. Dave Wayans, my opponent, failed his medicals. And just just a tough two years with just fights falling through. So I really haven't wanted to take the time off, but it's been forced upon me. But you've been training nonetheless? Oh, yes. Now, this is your debut with Bama USA. And my, my question for you is, uh, what was your incentive to want to fight with us on our card? You know, Matt, Mike Jasper is an incredibly tough opponent, and I feel this will be a great win for me, a great win for my career. You know, I'm trying to make this a lifestyle, make this, you know, a, a career. So Mike Jasper is my next stepping stone. Well, going into this, uh, he's a veteran with us, and uh, the last out of two of the three fights he's had with us has been uh, by TQ with his victory. And uh, is that a little bit more pressure on you, or does that help with your training, the way you've trained? You know, I, I love the pressure. I love a tough opponent. If I can go in there thinking he's going to knock my head off, it'll just give me to fight that much better. So I'm just really looking forward to it. An easy fight, I'd be a worse fighter than a tough fight. Now, you're fighting in the middle weight uh, at 185, but you used to fight at 205. What was your decision to drop the weight down? Yeah, I was always a smaller 205, and I never really thought that I could make 185, but with this new training schedule and my new team, new coaches and everything, they really pressed it on me that I can make the 185, new diet, new nutrition, everything, and uh, I'm feeling really good at the lower weight, and I feel that I can be a stronger, faster fighter. Do you think that's going to be to your advantage against Mike Jasper? Oh, absolutely. I know he doesn't really cut much weight, and I feel that's a mistake, so I feel I have the strength advantage and the height advantage on him. All right, well, going into this, uh, what can the uh, fight fans coming to this fight expect from you? Uh, a brawl. A brawl. I want to stand. I want to bang with him. I want to debut my hands, you know. My last three fights have been uh, won by submission, and I don't want to be known as a submission fighter. I want to be known as a stand-up brawler. You want to keep it standing and bang it out with Mike Jasper. He also likes to keep it standing and just get it in. Like you said, you know, he's had some TKOs and you've had some submissions for yourself. Going into this, do you think you guys have a shot for fight of the night? Oh, absolutely. I guarantee this will be the best fight on the card. You know, cardio is not an issue. It was before in the past, and I uh, took care of that problem. So I feel that was my last week link, and I'm just ready to go at it. Now, do you have a lot of family, friends, or anyone coming out to this fight for you? Oh, yeah. I have a, quite a big fan base down here, and I have a pretty good showing. I know Mike Jasper is hometown favorite, though. Fought for you guys a couple times, so uh, I may get booed a little bit, but once again, the pressure, I like it, and I'm ready. It's a little bit more incentive that uh, for those who can't make it to the fight can actually watch the fight on live stream, live, during your fight? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's great. I'm stoked on that you know my family all lives in Idaho and you know I have very few family actually down here in California so they never really get to see me fight and uh, so it'll finally be an opportunity for them to see what I can do are there any shout outs you want to give to your sponsors family or friends for this fight I just want to give a shout out to my gym San Diego Combat Academy they've been helping me a ton you know helping me train helping me get ready and I also want to give a shout out to my previous gym in Idaho and that was uh Boise Combat Academy, and that's with Team Twisted Genetics. You know, they're a big part of this as well. They prepped me for the last year before I moved down here to San Diego. So I just want to say thanks to all them. Well, best of luck with the rest of your training. Uh, we're looking forward to seeing you. Best of luck with the rest of your weight cut for, uh, coming up for this fight, and we look forward to seeing you at weigh-ins. All right, thank you. Come see me take out Mike Jasper, Bad Beat 7 for Bama USA. I'm Kyle Bolt, and I'm a Bad Beat fighter.